R&D Systems biotinylated proteins are carefully designed and selected for optimum performance. It begins inside the cell, where a DNA expression vector directs transcription and translation of the recombinant protein. Multiple expression systems and clones are screened and tested, and the best clone is chosen for scale-up production. The recombinant protein is purified and QC tested for bioactivity. For amine biotinylation, the recombinant protein is biotinylated using an optimized NHS biotin conjunction process. The end result is a biotinylated protein with a high biotin to protein ratio, important for applications requiring high signal strength and binding efficiency. Amine biotinylated proteins are designed for use in ELISA, immunoprecipitation, SPR, flow cytometry, and other applications. For our AviTag biotinylated proteins, we insert an expression-optimized AviTag DNA sequence within the coding region of the expression vector. This produces an AviTag recombinant protein that is recognized by the E. coli beer A ligase, which enzymatically biotinylates the lysine residue contained within the 15 amino acid AviTag. Site-specific labeling allows for uniform protein orientation when binding to a streptavidin surface. Restricting biotinylation to the AviTag means that the protein is left mostly unchanged and potential binding sites remain available. Advantages of controlled biotinylation Potential binding sites remain available. Specifically orient your protein on plates, beads, and other selected surfaces. With R&D Systems AviTag and amine biotinylated recombinant proteins, you now have a choice. It's your assay.